The one bright spot in these early days comes from one of the few ships of the non-existent U.S. Navy. Just three days after American forces surrender Detroit, the USS Constitution finds the HMS Guerriere off the New England coast. For the crew of the Constitution, the battle is intensely personal. The Guerriere is one of the most famous of the ships noted for impressment. Over the next three hours, the two slug it out. When solid shot fired from Guerriere's guns fails to penetrate the Constitution's solid oak timbers, the American vessel earns its immortal nickname, Old Ironsides. The Constitution returns to Massachusetts a hero, and a conflict that began in a political haze has its first real victory.